Today I am going to talk about the new responsive mode in Hoverify. So when you open the pop-up and click on the responsive option, you will see that um, the by, by default the site is same as where you initiated the responsive mode. And uh, by default you won't see any devices. So you can just add devices from here or click this plus option over here. So let's add a device and straight away you will see that um, there is operating system UI. If it's an iOS device, you will see the UI of iOS. And if I add an Android device here, you will see the UI of Android. Now this UI will adjust itself based on the um, landscape or the portrait view. And if you want to rearrange these devices, you can open this manage board pop-up where you can just slide the devices to rearrange them. You can also clear the board and add more devices to it. With the limitations of new manifest version 3 um, API in Chrome extensions and extensions in general, um, we cannot have user agent individual for um, all the devices. So the, there will be one user agent applied to all the devices, which you can change from here. By default, the user agent will be iPhone, but you can change it to Android or even add your custom user agent if you want. Um, you can you can also change other options. So let's just say if you don't want to see operating system or device frame, you can change that or even control the synchronization options. So you can disable synchronize uh, clicks and scroll if you want to. You can also change the zoom of the devices to fit more in one screen. Um, if they are taking uh, taking a lot of space, you can do that. You can also add your custom devices uh, by going to the add devices pop up and you can create a device here. Give it a size. I will. Um, Take the default size and and select the OS. Um, in my case, I will select Android and create the new device. And you can just select the new device and it will be added to the uh, board. Now there is also another tab uh, from this devices view. And when you go over here, you will see a simple responsive panel, which you can use to check the responsiveness of your site. Um, quickly. So if you have a site and you just want to see that house or every element uh, adjusting to the size change, you can do from here. So these were all the changes in the new responsive mode. Um, there are a couple of, couple of more features that I would like to add in this, um, panel, this responsive pan panel, especially, um, to disable scroll bar and to have a custom user agent here as well which I will probably do um, after the launch of uh, Hoverify version 4. So these were all the changes. I hope you would have liked them. And please let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions or any feature request. Thanks.